Tonight, a comeback 19 months in the making after a shooting at a house party in North Las Vegas left local basketball star Aaliyah Gales hospitalized. She is now making an impact for the USC women's basketball program and we show you her incredible road to recovery. A star for Spring Valley High School, Aaliyah Gales made her mark on the hardwood here in the Las Vegas Valley. The University of Southern California student athlete even made one of her dreams come true playing in the McDonald's All-American game in 2022. I've been dreaming about this since I was a little girl, so it's like finally get the opportunity to play in this is like a big stage for me. But those hoop dreams were almost stolen from her. On April 16th of 2022, Gales attended a house party in North Las Vegas and a night of fun turned into tragedy. Shots rang out, leaving Gales with what doctors say were 18 gunshot wounds. It was really devastating, you know, for her to like come this far and, you know, be injured like that. Like her whole career is at risk right now. The community rallied around her and showed their support. I knew Aaliyah since freshman year, you know, a really good friend. You know, I'm keeping her in my prayers, you know, you know, Spring Valley, you know, whole Vegas County got her. According to ESPN, Gales suffered fractures in all four limbs. Doctors say Gales underwent multiple surgeries to repair the damage and her road to recovery began. I'm feeling good, got my hair done. Feel like a new, got clothes on. So feel like a new uh, person, feel like me, feel like myself again. She told us her focus was on keeping her mind strong and working to get back on her feet and back on the court. Two months after the shooting, Gail started to learn to walk once again. Gail's enrolled at USC for the fall semester a year ago and spent her freshman year undergoing intense rehabilitation. Our first game last year, uh, it was really important to me to squeeze into, I was just, I just had had a baby, so I really had to squeeze into a jersey. Um, I squeezed into a number three jersey because for, for me, it just, you know, signifies that Aaliyah has been, is, and always will be our family. Through her determination and her strong mindset, Gales got back on the court right here in Las Vegas on Monday, November 6th. She took part in warmups as the Trojans beat the seventh ranked Ohio State Buckeyes 83 to 74 inside T-Mobile Arena. And then on Friday, November 10th, Gales played in her first game as a Trojan. Final 10 seconds. Will trickle down under Aaliyah Gale's watch as USC wins their home opener and proves the 2-0 on the young season. Gales only played in two minutes, but it was about the journey to get to those two minutes. I was definitely shaking in my boots. <laughs> <laughs> I was very happy. I don't, I don't care what time it was on the clock. I was just ready to get in there. It's pretty amazing um, is the understatement of the year to see her in the jersey and out there. And like I said, this is not an end point for her, um, but it's a really cool point and it's, um, it's forward from here. Truly an inspiring story. Well, yesterday, Aaliyah Gales played once again for the Trojans as they beat Lemoyne 93-42. to Gales played 12 minutes and finished with two assists and a rebound in the game. Best of luck to her and the Trojans the rest of the season.